Are you ready for bed? Hey, Nelly baby. Hey, Stamps. Hey, Balu. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Raver's Read. Uh, oh, yeah. I am having an absolute mare of a time at the moment. I have had on and off migraines now for the last couple of weeks. Are you grumpy? Are you a grumpy boy? What have you wiped all over your face? Oh yeah, he's in a mood with me because he's saying you're here and you're not feeding me, so I don't want to be friends. Oh, mama neck hurts as well. <laughs> so yeah, I've been having this issue with like on and off migraines and they're kind of kicking my butt. I, th I feel like I've lost my weekend. I have done absolutely nothing. I actually came down yesterday and I started another video. Um, I was going to take Nelly out for an epic gallop and we were going to have a lush day and I was going to get everyone all tied up and it's going to get itchy boy there all groomed and tied it up as well. He needs a real good brush. Oh, by the way, um, what's falling over all my clutter? I haven't mucked out yet today, guys, or tied at the yard in case you hadn't noticed. I did half of it this morning and my head was just splitting so much. I thought, screw it. I went back to bed, but it needs to be done now because it is my time. Uh, but yeah, Blueberry here is currently naked. We're conducting a little experiment. Oh, you're really grumpy. What's the matter? Oh, he's really not happy. Uh, yeah, we're conducting a little experiment to see if we can get away with uh, overwintering him naked. Um, it'd just be nice for him to have some time, you know, naked, because he never gets that time because of his sweet itch and his tendency to itch anyway. But he does seem to have calmed down a fair bit lately. So we thought, why not just have a go, see what happens. Um, just collecting up. I've literally, I, I've done Stumpy's stable this morning. Um, and obviously I cleaned his stable out before I put him in it and I poop at the yard, which is now full of poo again. But yeah, I've got, I've got a fair bit to do this evening. <laughs> I really don't want to do it. But the trouble is when you have horses, um, doesn't matter how crappy you feel, you still got to go out and feed them who pick after them, take care of them. Uh, that, you know, that has to be done regardless of anything else. So I need to suck it up and get on with it basically. And I need to get you some beatings. I do. Oh, you're such a grumpy boy. I'll give you a brush if my head's not splitting by the time I'm done, babe. You're a bit sticky, aren't you? Yeah. So yeah, the migraine's been great fun. Um, just, I can't remember if I soaked there. Uh, they're mashed this morning. Let's just double check that while I'm thinking about it. But yeah, the migraine's been great fun. It's actually, uh, it keeps changing sides, which is lovely. Mash is ready. That's always a good thing. Yeah, so it keeps changing sides. And the latest development is that I've got this horrendous pain in the back of my neck, like right at the base of my skull and down my neck. Oh my goodness, you guys, it hurts so bad. Um, yeah, so I've just been spending a fair bit of time led down in bed. So I've completely lost my weekend, which is very depressing because weekends are the only real daylight hours I get down here at this time of year. So it's very sad, but it is what it is. I'm actually having a look into some, um, some reflective gear and some lights and things like that so that maybe we can, we can push the boundaries a little bit with riding out in the mornings. Um, maybe we can head out a little bit earlier. It's usually light. It isn't what it is light before I get back from work, but I'm just hoping if we get some good reflective gear, we can sort of push that, that window of time I've got in the morning. Um, but we'll see. It'll be the shortest day soon. And before you know it, I'll be whinging and complaining that it's too hot again. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna stop waffling. I need to get these stables done um, before it gets dark, preferably, because it is gonna be dark in about 20 minutes. So let's crack on and get this done. Thank you. 
Yeah, I forgot to say as well, uh, Woody did that recently, <laughs> which is both very annoying and also very unlike him because he doesn't pull shoes. Um, I don't know quite what went wrong there. I guess Nelly must have laid into him and his backside just overtook his head and he must have overreached, but that's kind of annoying. Um, although on the flip side, it's not like I'm riding much at the moment. So what am I complaining about? <laughs> Are you enjoying those floor scraps, honey? Is this what you've been reduced to, huh? <laughs> so that's about a slice of haylage that Woody's got there. Oh my goodness. Oh, I am knackered. Oh, I need some chocolate. I've got some chocolate in my pocket, which Yes, I know chocolate's not the best thing when you have a migraine, but screw it, I need energy to get me through the next half hour or I'm going to keel over. <sighs> Literally, this zonks me when I get like this. I am, I'm knackered. I feel more tired now than I feel after a training session with those lunatics from Gloucester in armor. Literally. Whee. Um. Yeah, Woodster there has that was, that was a whole slice of haylage. Um, he didn't get the memo that, you know, gypsy cobs are supposed to be good doers and cheap to feed. <laughs> Literally, he eats like a thoroughbred. <laughs> he costs so much to feed, don't you, sweet boy? Are you hiding? Yes, you cost a lot to feed, darling. You don't, do you? Which I think upsets you because you like your food. But you do get a bit chubs, pretty girl. Right, chocolate break over. Let's get this other staple done. Whew. All right, staples are done to a fashion. Oh, oh, stop it. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Right, come on, guys. Come on. I know your tea's not in there. I'll get it in a sec. Come on. Here you go, babe. You've got your haylage. I'll get your buckets in a sec. Sausage, off to bed. Are you having a bromance? Are you having a bromance? All right, well, let me shut the gate then. Bless him, he does love his blues already. Oh, dang, the pigs are just screaming now. Off to bed, here you go. Good boy. They're all gonna be angry because their uh, the buckets aren't in there, but. I literally just wanted to get them in and out of the way because they kept looking at me. You know when horses give you that guilt trip look when you're late? They're all giving me that look and I'm like, I'm sorry, I haven't done it. I don't feel well. Just have a little patience, please. Oh, Piggy, you playing with your gate? You coming in stumps or are you working on that pile of uh, leftovers? You working on that pile of leftovers? That's fine, you stay there for another 10 minutes if you want. I've got to get everyone's buckets ready. Oh, one thing I really need to pull my finger out and deal with is getting some more lighting down here. Cause obviously I've got lights in the stables, which is great, but I need to get some yard lights cause I'm getting fed up of fumbling around in the dark and I equally detest wearing head torches. They kind of give me headaches. I think they give me like pressure headaches. Basically my head is a sensitive little pain in the backside. <laughs> right, um, should we get some din dins? Yeah, let's get some din-dins, cutie pie. Right, I think I'm actually gonna wrap it up there, guys. Um, it's, as you can see, it's pretty much dark. There's not a lot else you're gonna be able to see now anyway. Um, I have made an executive decision and Mr. Blueberry here. Unfortunately, you will not be having a brush this evening, sir. It's just not gonna happen. I'm literally, I'm hanging. I'm just gonna feed them. I don't even think I'm gonna sweep the yard. I'm just gonna feed everyone, make sure everyone's got water, make sure everything's kind of ready for the morning. Um, and I'm gonna go home and get back to bed. Should we get your din dins, handsome boy? Yes. Yes, okay. Right, thank you very much for hanging out with me this evening, guys, on this rather pitiful little vlog. Um, and I'll see you on our next video, which hopefully will be a much livelier, happier, more interesting one where hopefully I don't have a splitting headache. <laughs> See you next time guys. Bye.